Today I'm going to show you how you can go from this to this in just five minutes or less. Hey everyone, it's Ariel. Welcome back to another video. This video is the beginning of a little series I'm starting that's gonna be called Tip Tuesday. Basically, every Tuesday I'm gonna make a video and it'll be probably a shorter video that is a little tip. So it might be a beauty tip, it might be a hair tip, it might be a life tip. Who knows? But every Tuesday, I'm gonna post one of these videos. I'm pretty excited. This is the first video of that series. And for this video, if you don't already know by the title or thumbnail or whatever, I'm gonna show you guys how you can just make yourself look, and your face specifically, a little bit brighter, smoother, more awake, just a little bit better. And it really only takes a few minutes five minutes or less. So yeah, that is what today's video is. I just wanted to explain a little bit more what it is that I'm trying to do today and what this little Tip Tuesday thing will be. So yeah, let's just get right into the video. So here I am in my bathroom. I'm starting off by taking my spoolie brush and just brushing through my brow, making sure all the hairs are in place. And then from there, I'm gonna take my tweezers just any pair of slant tip tweezers should be good. Before I start tweezing, I always pull at my skin, kind of pushing in either direction with both of my fingers to create extra pressure. And that will just help me get the area nice and tight so that I can get really nice and close up to that brow and make sure that all I'm tweezing is the hair and not my skin because that hurts. So yeah, that's what I'm doing, just pulling and tweezing as I go, just getting rid of any hairs that are growing out where I have previously waxed. And by the way, guys, if you haven't seen my video on waxing your brows, you should definitely watch that one too. I'll leave a link to it somewhere here. I always try to wax my brows like once every month or so, and that keeps them looking good most of the time. So this video here is just more of what I do for maintenance once I see those hairs growing back in from the wax. So definitely recommend you watch that video first if you haven't already seen it. And I do feel like this is something that a lot of people do already. Some people even do this every day, but of course some people maybe don't do this. And so I thought it might be a good tip and a great way to just make yourself feel a little bit better in a really short amount of time. I love finding these little hacks that help you just look and feel a little bit better. And especially when it's this easy to add to your routine. And once both brows are done, I always do the little unibrow as well because that part can get pretty fuzzy too. <laughs> So you wanna make sure you're cleaning up that part as well. And once you feel like that's done, you can move on to the upper lip. Now for this part, I use a pair of scissors actually. I think these ones that I'm using, I got in a manicure kit. So I'm not sure if they're supposed to be used for what I'm using them for, but they seem to work perfectly for me. So that's what I'm using. They do have a curved tip to them, which I think does make it a little bit easier to curve around my skin. I'm just taking those and I'm using them curved tip up, if that makes sense. So the curve is kind of bouncing off my skin. What I do is just go in really small sections and I'm kind of bouncing it off of my skin. So I'm cutting and then bouncing it up and away from my skin. And this will help to just remove the hair, but you won't be cutting yourself at all, which we obviously don't want. So just do this really slowly. I'm also kind of moving my lip and then holding my lip down to make it a little bit easier to get all of those hairs. And I'm going in the opposite direction the hair grows in, so I'm going upwards and just kind of working my way up until I get to the middle and then switching around to the other side to do the exact same thing. And that is it. So now my brows are nicely cleaned up, my upper lip is no longer fuzzy and I feel like my skin just looks so much more smooth and I don't know, I just feel so much better after I do this. I sometimes really put this off but it really is a good thing to add to your routine so if you've never tried this before i definitely recommend it but yeah that is my first tip tuesday this is how you can make yourself look and feel a lot better in just five minutes or less i literally didn't do anything else i just tweezed my brows and trimmed my upper lip i feel like it makes such a big difference it's crazy what just that little thing can do so definitely try this out for yourself let me know if you like it let me know if it works for you i really hope you like this video thank you so much for watching if you did like this video please make sure to give it a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe if you're not subscribed already and i will see you in my next video bye